Uh, hello, uh, as we can see here is the day clock I just updated and now it is just uh, updated the state succeed. Okay, let's click here refresh. And now we can see the firmware already between already become to 1040. Okay, let's click here. Here is the inverter connected to the dead clock. And this one is the inverter type 3, it means the hybrid inverter. And the rated power is 8 kilowatt, it means the 8 kilowatt to the hybrid inverter. And now uh, we can, if you want to set the parameters, click here. And now, as we can see, here is the many, many, many items here. Battery setting, system worker model, grader setting, smart load, basic setting, advanced function. So many options here. And uh, here, and this. This one is the customer nice the command. It's used the, the remote command. Mm. Normally for our customer we recommend to you to them use the this the batch parameters. Okay, let's uh, click here read. Read is the current parameters for the hybrid inverter. Now already completed, we can see the battery type is the BMS, lithium battery, and the maximum discharge current is 185 April amps, and the battery low, low SOC is 15%, and the float voltage is 15.3.6 volts. Yeah, here is the many parameters here. Let's turn to another one. This one system work model. Read. Okay, completed. Now the uh, hybrid inverter working model is ceiling first. Ceiling first it means the, the solar energy and the, the excess energy will will flow will sold to the sold to the grid. And also, uh, it takes care of the time of time of use. There is so many parameters we can see. Here is the energy pattern, battery first or loader first. Here is the zero spot power. And uh, here is the time of use um, period. And the air hybrid inverter, um, it has the six time periods we can, we can set for battery charging, for battery charging and the discharge. Uh, and uh, now we can see this one, this one, 100 actually it means the uh, 1 o'clock in the morning, 1 o'clock a.m. This one is uh, 5 o'clock uh, a.m. This one is uh, 9 o'clock a.m. This, this one is the 1 o'clock p.m. And this one is the This one is the CD motor time one power. It mean it means in this in this time period, if the battery discharge, the maximum the maximum discharge 
discharge power of a battery is uh, um, 8000 volts. And uh, here is for the battery SOC. And the ceiling mode time time to charge. It means in this time period you can choose to use the uh, grid charge or diesel generator charge. Here is the grid setting, grid model. Uh, normally we choose the general standard. And here is the grid con uh, reconnection time. And uh, here's the frequency grid type. As we can see, it has the uh, 220, 120 um, split face, and uh, 120 and three face, 120 single face. And uh, here's the uh, um, grid voltage parameters. Here is the smart load. We can define. We can choose it as a um, generator input. Or smart load output or micro inverter input. And we also can, uh, can choose the um, diesel generator input to enable or disable. Here's the basic setting such as the dim and the system time. And uh, here is the advanced function, arc setup. This one is for the uh, US market. And here is the GMP7. Here is the title. 